Okay, just bought the Nebula Turbo. I heard it was a really bad car to drive, but I'm buying it anyways because it's a Volvo, and also its name has the word Nebula. That means I have to buy it. Well, I don't have to buy it, but I really like the word Nebula. As well as Nexus. Now I just need to wait for it to be delivered. I plan to sell that car. I'm not evil. But this car right here. <laughs> This apparent junk car is here to stay for now. The Nebula Turbo. It's a Volvo car. And I already have the Warner and I have the True Brick. Well, actually, that's not. That's not Volcar, but still, it's pretty close, so. Yeah, I, have, I kind of have a collection of some sort. Oh, I also have the Fagiloa, too. That's a Volcar car, so I'm, I guess I'm collecting Volvo cars. Hopefully I won't get bullied in this session. Here we go. Too bad. It reminds me of the... Oh, what was it called? It's that new SUV. No, it's not that new, but it's still the fastest SUV now. The Taurus. Taurus. Okay. I hit a bump and I can kind of see. I can see why it's not likable. I felt like I wasn't in total control of the steering wheel. But we're gonna, I'm gonna upgrade this to the max. With the uh, engine. Um, that's what I was talking about. See. Actually, before we do anything else, I'm just gonna upgrade it. Oh, this is going, oh dear. Oh dear, turbo. Okay. Well, I just wasted a lot of money. But I like the look of this car. It's a little bit too long for my liking, but like, I like small cars. But, you know, this is kind of good enough. Okay, I like I like these two. I might go for a destroyed car build. Or actually I plan to make this a red and purple to make it look like a actual nebula. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Nah. Exhaust. Epic Bean Can. Why do I feel like that's a reference to Killer Bean Forever? No. <laughs> oh, I'm getting Asia by vibes from this. I have a car called the Asia. It's a sedan, and you can put sticker bombs on it. Oh, that was one of my favorite cars. Ooh. I never understood light covers. Like, what were their function? 
for the car to be only used in the daytime. Something like that. Fogs. Yeah, I, there's there's still a lot that I don't know about cars. I would not call myself a car expert ever. No, I'm far from that. Okay, I'm starting to like this. Oh, no words needed. Because drift car. Hmm. Wow. I really like that. It looks cool. Although that middle part looks kind of weird. It looks alien, almost. Okay, uh, if I remember, I'll come back to this later. It's a really hard decision what to do. The 70s called. Ooh, look at that. Windshield cover. Is that what you call it? And there's the line here. Nordic racer. McDonald's looking car. Geometric. Oh, that looks good. The colors, the coloring isn't that bad on this one. Yes, I approve, but not my taste exactly. Okay, here we go. I do like rust builds, but uh, keeping it real. At first, I thought this was like anime-looking thing, but it's actually street art or graffiti. Rusty Shark. Hawaiian Snow Rally. Like that is. Rather, it's simple, but pleasant. Oh, that reminds me, I went. Oh, dude. This actually brings back a memory of me um, snow tubing. Down like a artificial hill. Well, not completely artificial, I would assume. A steampunk. Okay, this is cool. The gears, the brass, and the brass color. Actually, it looks more like gold. Doodles of doodles. Okay, that is metal. That is metal right there. I like the geometric design. Okay, enough rambling about that. You know, I actually don't like the color magenta. I think it's a really dangerous and scary color. Okay, okay, this is the color I'm going with. And I, I know it looks atro atrocious, but it looked a lot cooler in my head. It was supposed to be like a purple and a red. Because nebulas, like, when I think of them, it's like red and purple in space. I know there's different colors, but I don't know. Let's see, louvers. I don't really care for those. Neither do I do with mud guards. Oh, actually, maybe for this car. Yeah, maybe for this car they might. Uh, no. Yeah, I think this is neat. Oh no. Yeah, this. Roll cage. So then you should it re? Uh, I don't know if it needs a roll cage. Weak. Weekend vacation, large roof rack, alpine rack, stack of crap, junk trunk. Wouldn't that be on the trunk then? 
Yeah, I, I don't think I'm really interested in the top. Or oh, there's the sticker bomb again. Carbon trunk. Oh, that looks weird with the red. Rusty trunk. Sports wing. Mid level wing. Drift wing. Race wing. Oh, that's weird. Oh, wait a minute. I think I might know why it looks weird. Hold on. I want to do this for now. Beautiful. LS custom style. No. I don't know. I don't know. Can this, can it get any worse? Hmm. I think I might actually like this. Uh, I don't know. Mid-level wing. Let's see here. You know what? I'm just going to keep it like this. Should I change the wheels? You know what? No, I'm not going to change the wheels. Windows. Yeah, we're going to tint them. Fenders. I already did that. Grill. All right, let's see. Oh, hey, look at that. Epilepsy. Let's just see how good this car is, if it's good at all. Does it have anything good to offer? Will it redeem itself and not be like how people said it was. Cool. Alright, so I can see why people do not like this car. It's just like what he said. Going over the bumps just changes its direction. Yeah, this car is not exactly living up to its name. Like, maybe it's some kind of drift car, and I'm just stupid. Uh, it seems like a drift car. Yep, this driving experience ain't it. Not really good. Yeah, I guess I wouldn't recommend this car unless you're a hardcore Volvo or Volker fan. Oh, and I 
Found it, okay. Yeah. I might. I, I'm not going to drive this car very often, although there's a lot of cars that I own and don't drive a lot often, so, yeah. So something I want to speak out with my opinion is do Invader Zim movie, Invader Zim Enter the Florpus. Before I say anything else, let's just look at it. Yeah, I'm gonna have to put a different purple in it or just make it all red. Oh, wait a minute, I have an idea. I could put wine red on it and put a regular red as the... Okay. Well, it looks like we're going back to the thing, the Los Santos. But anyways... I watched Invader Zim enter the Florpus, and I have to say it's rather, it was rather disappointing to me. I thought it was an okay movie, but it didn't live up to its expect expectations that I had for it. And I felt like some of the jokes, especially with Gurr and his, you know, personality, I felt like they tried too hard with it, or just... Invader Zim's the tone of the the tone of the show in general doesn't match up with the movie very well. Oh, I hate this music that's going on right now. And just the way Zim does his plan is I find kind of stupid. And the way Dib reverses it is also stupid. Dumb. But a lot of Invader Zim fans seem to enjoy it. And I wouldn't call myself a big Invader Zim fan. I like the show, but I w wouldn't binge watch it. Unless I had the open... Unless I had the opportunity to. Actually, I guess I do have the opportunity to buy, like, season one or two off of the PlayStation Store, maybe. But, eh. That can happen with any show or cartoon. Okay, the colors, the colors. This seems a little bit better. The purple is kind of removed, but... The, the wine red is supposed to, or maybe it is an illusion, I don't know. Maybe I don't know what I'm talking about. I don't. Overall, this car is kind, it's pretty disappointing in terms of handling. I wish Rockstar made it kind of just, I prefer just normal average handling over this. Unless I can properly drive it without problems, but I've already ran into a few. I think that I made the color a little bit, just slightly better and less bad looking. Once again, it's one of those cars where, like, you can make it look destroyed looking, which I appreciate. I like this, I especially like the hood designs, that's what stood out the most, along with the front bumper design. For the price it is, I wouldn't recommend buying unless you're a vo uh, big Volvo or Volcar, Volvo fan. I'd probably just wait until it gets a discount. But, yeah. I usually don't commentate during customization videos for GTA cars, but oh well. I did it this time. I 
Yeah, it's seven. It's a low rider. All broken and destroyed. It looks like it came from the zombie apocalypse. It's a radioactive truck. All right, yeah, it's seven. You drive it. Whoa! The frequent fluffer is not playing around. This car will destroy you. Oh! Oh my gosh! Oh my god! Oh dear! Video clip. I'm saving that. That was epic. Wait a minute, did you just saw someone? Oh gosh, oh! All right, you wanna fight? Get back here! Yeah, we got him. Ooh! Oh, oh, no, you had no! Oh, no, you don't. No, you don't. Ooh! We got him good. Epic. Yes! Yeah! Okie dokie! It's a Mario time! Oh, you make me so happy! Oh ho ho ho!